Hello and welcome to Brandy's Poetry Corner. Um, my next poem is from this book. The Penguin Book of Contemporary Verse. The word contemporary in this um, case is quite interesting because I probably bought the book in 1966 um, and the poems in it go from 1918 to 1960. So not contemporary in the sense of 2020 at all. I found this lovely poem by Norman Nicholson. Um, uh, it starts with a quote from uh, the book of James or the Proto-Evangelium, which is uh, one of the apocryphal books. Uh, the quote being, now I, Joseph, was walking and I walked not. It's about that turn of the universe where Christ comes to be incarnated. So, A Turn for the Better by Norman Nicholson. Now I, Joseph, was walking, and I walked not, between the allotments on a December morning. The clouds were mauve as a crocus, peeling black petals, and a sparse pollen of snow came parping down on the bare ground and the greenhouse groins and dun. Tight-headed chrysanthemums crumpled by the frost. The cock in the henhouse blustered to its perch on the lid of the swill bucket, rattled its red at the fluttering flakes, levered its throat open, and not a croak quaked out. I looked about me. The snow was stock still in the sky, like pluckings of cotton wool glued on a grocer's window, and down in the brown of the dyke a smoky feather lit on a robin's head, between the black glass alley eyes and the gimlet beak, and never a flick it gave to shake it off. Workmen on the electric cable track swung picks in the air and held them there, rigid. Raised bait to mouse and never took a bite. One, putting up a hand to scratch his head, shifted the peak of his cap a couple of inch and never scratched. A dead leaf drifting, hung, bracketed against the wire netting, like a pin caught on a magnet. For at that minute, making was made. History rolled, backward and forward into time. Memory was unfolded, like a quick discovery. Old habits were invented, old phrases coined. The tree grew down into its sapling self, the sapling into the seed. Cobbles of wall and slate of rafters were cleft and stratified again as rock, and the rock unweathered itself, a cloud height higher, and the sea flowed over it, and brand new now stretched on either hand to then and some day, might have and perhaps. Then suddenly the cock coughed up its crow, the robin skittered off, and the snow fell like a million pound of shillings, and out in the beginning always of the world I heard the cry of a child. Thank you. I remember shillings. <laughs> they were silver and they're now worth 5p. Uh, for other poems read by me um, on the subject of Advent Hope and other things, uh, look me up Brandy Pearson on YouTube. Thank you.